So we have the Chicago Portage, a history of people and travel. There's a long history of people traveling this region. American Indians, explorers, French and American fur traders, settlers, and travelers to the west have all passed before. Before roads, rivers, and lakes were the quickest path to the travel and transport heavy loads. But bodies of water don't connect to each other in the way a modern transportation network does. Early travelers had to carry or portage their boats, gear, and goods across the land and gaps to make the connections to the river system. The American Indians. For thousands of years of local American Indians used this portage sites as they traveled the region in the dugout canoes for hunting, trapping, trading, and making war. They shared their knowledge with the first European explorers. So right where I'm at is such an awesome and beautiful place. Okay, so then we have the portage site, the forest preserve of Cook County. So we're going to go over here. The site preserves the west end and the old Chicago Portage, which linked in the Illinois River and Lake Michigan. They do actually have a map and then we are here so it is between Harlem Archer Avenue and Portage Creek which is Portage Trail the Chicago trades on its natural advantage so as you can see then they have the map which I'm gonna show you guys right now so this is And then this is the old map, which is very, very old, and that's how they got the new one, which is over there. So this is where they would trade all the goods, and I think it's just such a beautiful forest preserve. So we're going to come over here, and look at how gorgeous the sun is, and I hope nobody's getting motion sickness. So I'm going to show you guys how beautiful this is. Just look at how absolutely beautiful they put this statue. And I'm trying so hard not to make this rocky. Look how cool. So beautiful. Okay, let's go over here. to show you guys. Okay, so it says, along these waterways and trails, a history has passed. The Chicago Portage has served as a connecting link between the Great Lakes and the Mississippi River system. So it's just called the Chicago Portage, the Waterway West. In 1673, led by American Indians, explorers Marquette and Juliet became the first Europeans to cross the portage. The route encouraged and development of the L and M Canal and the growth of Chicago. So, basically, it says everything right there. This was to transport all the goods. And it's just absolutely amazing. They did such a wonderful job on this. So beautiful, guys. So I really did want to share this with you guys. It's absolutely amazing. 
And I did want to show you guys over here, there is another sign. Actually, there's two other signs, so we're going to look at both. Okay, so right here, this just has the Chicago Portage National Historic Site, designed January 3rd, 1952. I mean, it's just absolutely so beautiful. So not only is this historic, but this is where America and like all the trading with the goods and everything started. So I really wanted to share this with you guys. And then I did want to show you guys over here. Let me show you guys. So here is the map and it'll tell you everything about this site. Let's look at these pictures. The second Fort Dearborn in construction. So that was Dearborn. I think this is so cool. So the actual sign is right in front of here. So if you guys ever want to visit here, it is an amazing, an amazing place. So absolutely beautiful. And I just want you guys to see how beautiful it is over here. So this is a historic site. I'm actually standing on somewhere where you feel like once you're like walking or working out back there in the woods, you could just feel that it is very historic and it has meaning and it's just such an amazing, beautiful place.